I'm Josh Milliron here with Charger Vision. I'm here with Coral Grimmett. Coral, um, what has been your toughest challenge this season? Um, an injury before the season started. How have you overcome that? Um, just getting healed and then working hard afterwards. Um, what are your thoughts about running at OSU this weekend? Pretty nervous. There's going to be some good teams from Texas, but excited. Yep. I'm Kyler, here with Charge Vision, and this is Braylon Couture. All right, Braylon, you recently got a new PR. How does that affect your mentality going into your next meet? Man, um, it's been really inspirational, you know, seeing where I came from last year and taking that motivation I had last year and bringing it on to this year and just building it on further and further. You know, guys win me every step of the way, practicing, giving all my, giving my all every single practice and seeing how it results every single meet. You know, it's just crazy to see. All right, what is your pre-race ritual? So I have a bracelet. It is 2 Corinthians 5, 7. It says for we walk by faith, not by sight. And also I do a breath prayer, so give me that peace um, every single race. And, you know, sometimes I'm nervous, but, you know, with God it's all possible. You know, don't stress any meets. Don't stress at all. So. All right, that's great. How do you think the team will do in the next meet? Man, Charge, we about, to t we about to turn up. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be at OSU. It's going to be a lot of schools, but, you know, I'm ready. I'm happy for all of us. I believe that we're all great, and we got a lot to, we got a lot to show. So, yeah, we're going to do amazing. Right, go Chargers. Uh, back here with Charger Vision. Um, I'm here with? Finn Martin. Finn, uh, do you think hosting a meet helps you run better? I think it does. Uh, having the school come out uh, and motivate you, uh, all the runners, it's, it really makes you run faster, in my opinion. Nice. Um, on October 10th, y'all are hosting a big meet with about 45 teams. What do you think, what are your thoughts going into that one? Well, uh, it's going to be fun having all the students come out, of, like previous question. I mean, it's going to be motivating. We're going to run fast. We know the course, so we have the advantage, and uh, I think we're going to win. Thank you. Hi, I'm here with uh, Coach John Champney. How has the team progressed this season compared to the last? Uh, well, the season um, is going really well. We've got a, a pretty young team. We don't have any seniors on the team. And, uh, man, they've really, they've really lived up to the expectations uh, that we've, we've put on them for this season and um, just excited to get into the postseason. How is the team affected after losing last year's seniors? Um, it's always a it's always a big hit when you lose some some outstanding seniors and leaders, um, and but we we had some some younger runners ready to step up into those roles and they've been super successful and we're having a great season. How are you preparing the team in these next two weeks for regionals and state? We are just kind of finishing our like the main training part of our season. Um, uh, we'll really kind of work them real hard through the next two weeks and then we'll start to back off and taper. Um, as we get into the regionals. All right, thank you, Coach. Yeah.